国防部侦测到中国解放军机近期持续在台海周边活动。TVBS 国际评论员余文琪专访美国参谋联席会议前主席穆伦，假使中国解放军持续增强作战能力，是否有攻台可能？ Uh, at some point in time,、uh, I, I suspect they will.、Um, uh, certainly, with this leader, different from his predecessors, this leader being Xi Jinping, has made it pretty clear、uh, that we cannot continue、uh, specifically along the lines of where we've been. And China has been much more aggressive, actually, in every sphere. The, the military moves. Get an awful lot of publicity, but China has been very aggressive and active in isolating Taiwan economically, diplomatically, politically, as well as militarily. The military operations are much more aggressive. 美国中情局局长伯恩斯先前透露，根据情报显示，大陆国家主席习近平可能已经命令军队在二零二七年进攻台湾，警告外界不可低估习近平对台野心。对于这个时间点，穆伦怎么看 ？When I'm asked about it, An invasion in Taiwan from China. There's only one person on Earth that knows the answer to that question, and that's the president of China. That's Xi Jinping. So I, it's an unknown.、Uh, I think、uh, he's been pretty clear to tell his military, the PLA, to be ready by 2027. But I believe、uh, that Xi Jinping and his、uh, and his leadership team are looking at. Uh, what's going on in Ukraine? The Taiwanese defense capability is also increasing. Very wary of what's going on with respect to China. Mu Lun is a pushback. The U.S. Navy is a rich military experience. Last year, he led the Biden administration to come to Taiwan to meet with the Vice President. Maintaining peace and stability across the Taiwan Strait is not just a U.S. interest, but also a global one. 穆伦当时旋风来台三十小时，与府院国安外交高层全都碰到面。他熟知台海情势，也了解台湾政党文化。对于明年一月的总统大选，他有几点建议。There is an election in January, and we, the U.S., have not been involved in in Taiwanese elections. And who gets elected? That really is up to the Taiwanese people, and that's really what democracy is all about. So any leader, whether it's you know from the KMT or Uh, or from the DPP, has they every leader has to be very careful、uh, about the rhetoric. Clearly, given the situation and the level of of intensity that we're in right now, it, which could be very dangerous. 美国智库外交关系协会最新报告指出，中国大陆军事实力提升，且不放弃以武力实现两岸统一。美国应加紧强化核武，实质加强美台伙伴关系，仍要维持一中政策形成的既有政治架构。至于美国是否应该维持对台战略模糊，穆伦认为战略模糊带来四十多年的和平，战略模糊与战略清晰，两方都有支持者，直接区分太过简化，仍需再多讨论。特别编辑新闻综合报道。想看最完整的新闻内容，记得下载 TVBS 新闻网 APP。